Welcome, I'm Dr. Melina Roberts and I'm here to answer your health questions. And one of the questions I've been asked is, should I avoid the goitrogenic foods if I have a thyroid condition? Now, I remember learning about these goitrogenic foods back in school and they were foods that if you consumed them, that they were shown to suppress the thyroid function. Now, these foods are things like broccoli and cauliflower and kale and spinach and Brussels sprouts. These foods are really highly nutritious, coniferous vegetables. And, you know, to me, I really was having a tough time telling people to stay away from these highly nutritious foods. So I wanted to do a little bit more research into these gortrogenic foods um, before I started telling people to be avoiding these highly nutritious foods. So what I found in my research was that these coniferous vegetables, that they break down into a product called glucosinolates, and these glucosinolates, what they do is they interfere with iodine uptake and what they do because of that interference, they suppress the function of the thyroid. But if you look further into the research, what you find is that this is only a problem if the patient is deficient in iodine or has insufficient uptake of iodine. So what that tells me is that we need to make sure that patients have adequate amounts of iodine. And if they have adequate amounts of iodine, then they don't need to be avoiding these coniferous um, goitrogenic foods. So it all comes down to making sure that patients have adequate iodine when they have a thyroid condition, and then we don't need to be telling them to be avoiding these gortrogenic foods. So I hope that helps to answer your question, and I encourage you to share this with your friends and family, to press the like button, to make a comment below, and until next time, continue to learn, grow, and build health.